And now, laughs from the past. <laughs> to be honest with you, though, I am knackered. Look at my eyes, Mrs. Knackered. Half past four this morning, phone's rung. Right, I picked it up, it's the Coast Guard from Bridlington, and I realised I'm a name dropper. <laughs> he said, is that Mr. Marshall? I said, it is. He said, I've got some devastating news for you. We just found your mother-in-law, she's dead. Uh, she's floating head first here in the harbour at Bridlington, and she's got four lobsters hanging off her. <laughs> what, what's they want us to do? Half past four. Well, I rubbed my eyes and said, well, you keep two. Give me other two, then set her again. Ha! Ha! We don't get on the cow. My name's Paul Daniels. <laughs> Say yes, Paul. Yes, Paul. Sod off, Paul. Sod off, Paul. You don't like him. <laughs> I'll do a prop trick. Uh, I'll come down there. I'll arrive down there, all right? <laughs> Take a card, sir, anyone you wish. <sighs> Shuffle it while I go over here. <laughs> Take a card, sir. Don't mind me calling you, sir, it's only in fun. Okay. Good. <laughs> Good. Now, you notice there's a little hole in each one. You see it? All right, nothing to do with the trick. <laughs> Remember that card, and could you hold it up and show him? Hold yours up and show him. There you are, look, different. <laughs> <laughs> Tear this one in half. Go on, it's not a phone book, it's a card. <laughs> Put the pieces in the middle, and I'll pick it out and tell you what it is. You weren't going to do it then, were you? <laughs> oh, no. no, keep the bits. Now, his card is different to yours, because he tore it up. I'll cut these, put yours on the top, and I'll put mine straight on top of yours like that. And it's in the middle. Now I shall look around the room for a beautiful woman to help me with this trick. <laughs> OK. No, I'm only jesting. <laughs> There's a beautiful lady. He said, you are beautiful. Yes, you are. Don't argue. Just take no notice of them. Hold, hold the cards. Hold the cards. Right. Look at me. <laughs> Close your eyes. Dark, isn't it? <laughs> Mind you, I can before magic. I could come back to your house tonight. Make love to you. And in the morning, I disappear. <laughs> I can't do that, because I've got the missus waiting for me at home, and... Uh, we, we, we're having a... Uh, you do go through times when life doesn't seem worth living, don't you? With, with your marriage and stuff. I mean, my weight used to depress me. But I just suddenly thought, well... Sod it. Back in 1994, and you're going to find this quite upsetting, but I went out and I bought 5,000 aspirins. Aww. And I took the first four and I felt better. <laughs> but Blackpool, I went to one of them fortune tellers in Blackpool and I said, I said, I want my palm red, and she hit it with a spanner. She said, uh, do you believe in reincarnation? I said, no, and I didn't believe it when I was a frog. He was a nice man, my granddad. He died in his sleep at a Max Bygraves concert, and... Uh, <laughs> hmm. My grandma said he was a model husband. She said, unfortunately, he wasn't a working model, but he was... <laughs> Only ever had one job, my granddad. He was a ringer out for a one-arm window cleaner, and... Um, <laughs> My other granddad's still alive, by the way. He's 93, and he, uh, he, uh, he, um, he's a commode restorer, that's it. And uh, 
Yeah, he collects antiques and he stains furniture, but he doesn't realise he's doing it. And, uh, <laughs> but it, well, it, it... Look! Up there! In the sky! Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's not. <laughs> No, it's not. It's... <laughs> this is very mobile, all right? <laughs> it's me. With my powers of X-ray vision. <laughs> Would like to dedicate this set I've done this evening to my nan. Uh, if I may, she passed away um, 13 days ago. She was the love of my life. She was 93 when she left us, which I realise is a, it's a great age. And I think she died in the best way that any of us can go. She sat down in a chair. She closed her eyes, she went to sleep, and um, she never woke up again. And that's the best way that any of us... Well, to be fair, the dentist, he shit himself. <laughs> That, that was a lie, wasn't it, obviously? That was... <laughs> Sorry. I know you shouldn't have favourite grandparents, but I had one, my granddad. He's still living, about 97. Good age, that, isn't it? 97. Called me Grandad Spider-Man, we called him. You know, my granddad. <laughs> Spider-Man. Don't call him because he's agile, just can't get out of the bath. Yeah. <laughs> Which one did he get? Which one was it? <laughs> you have to, I'll have to, and set her again. <laughs> Hello, this is Rob Charles and thank you for watching the video, Laughs from the Past. Very much appreciated and uh, I'd appreciate it even more if you subscribe to the channel down below there. Or if you want to see the previous video, then just look over there. Uh, thanks once again for watching and uh, thank you for all your support.